What up, me? What up, me? Welcome back to our channel. I'm Gwen Zamora, and then this is David Samurai. So very handsome. So we are currently back in Manila. We just moved into a new home in the city. We were just reminiscing about our whole farm experience and our lockdown experience which is why we're doing this video kind of sparing snippets of our whole experience at the farm we just want to dedicate this to how much we miss the farm and we might be going back soon actually yeah, so week, stay back. tuned to more videos of us back at the farm we should be there next week yun so we have a list of questions that we are going right. to answer first question <laughs> is why did we choose to spend lockdown at the farm? We the the first thing that came to mind was we needed to kind of escape to a safe haven, especially because back in Manila we were staying in a condo unit, which was more risky, especially with the virus. One of the that was the main reason why we chose to go to the farm. We escaped to the farm because we wanted to be safe, especially for Cooper and for less all of crowded, us. Yes, not too less many crowded. Not stuck inside. Yes, we uh, wouldn't. Condo. We wouldn't have to go through the process of going through so many people. Like you don't know how many people that go in the elevator. You mm -hmm. don't know how sanitized it is and whatnot. Mm -hmm. So the farm was really like our first option, our first and only option. Yum. Second question. <laughs> what were your days like at the farm? It was pretty fun, no? It was uh, very chill. So first thing in the morning, we would have coffee. We would hang out with Cooper. We would feed Cooper and then we'd take Naya for her pee. And <laughs> poo poo. Yes, and then um, we would work out and then we would prepare lunch. After lunch, lunch we would rest, we would hang out, we'd play have with Cooper and then we have a nap. And then after the nap, David does some house chores because it's no longer hot anymore. He would Water the garden. Take care of the garden. No, in the morning, pala you water the garden. Pag ano gising na. Uh oh. Uh, direction na na. Dilig yung garden. And then, and then so in the afternoon. Sunset walks. Yeah, and then after you do all your chores, we have the sunset walks. And then we prepare dinner. Yeah. So that was our day, you know, very chill, very uh, yes. laid back lifestyle. Mm -mm. Question number three. How was the food like? Masara. When's yes. cooking? Delicious, guys. Yes. I look forward to lunch and dinner and snacks. Because um, at the farm, but I had more time to focus on food, mm -hmm. and we had an abundance of produce that we could play around with, mm -hmm. and we always got fresh seafood. We got fresh meat. We got fresh kambing, pork, uh -oh. chicken. Lahat na no. Uh -oh. My favorite was the. Ano yung, we was actually like have a video oh. coming out about the kambing. Oh, I don't know that was. Caldereta. That was caldereta. Uh, adobo. Basta madami. Tinola, <laughs> Tagalog, ano, manok. Sige, next question. How was it adjusting to the province life? It was super easy to adjust um, because we would always go there every weekend. Mm -hmm. So we always kind of missed it and always wanted to go back. And then stay there for a long yes. period of time and ex fully experience it. So having spent lockdown there kind of ticks, ticked five the months, box. No? Yeah, we were there for five months. It ticked the box of us wanting to stay at the farm more. Mm -mm. Not so, feeling bitin. Oh oh, masayang experience like we na ranasan namin yung province life na gusto talaga namin na maranasan. Oh, you have to really experience it to understand. Oh oh, kasi like when we lived in the city and we would go back every weekend, parang bitin palagi. But once we got to fully immerse ourselves for five months over there, oh. super serap talaga ng feeling. Next question: How we feel about Cooper being in the province? 
I love spending lockdown at the province in the province with Cooper because we really got to see his milestones. We got to fully see his growth in just a span of four or five months. It's crazy Standing, how Standing, crawling, how fast eating on his own. Yes, from sit so from crawling from sitting to standing, eating on his own, his taking first steps, words. his first words. Grabe talaga yung experience na yon, where you get to really see it kasi wala, wala kang distractions. As in, our time and days were just really revolved around him. 24-7, mm -hmm. no? Oh, so that was a good experience. During lockdown, everyone were doing do-it-yourself. Projects, yes! Wow. So we did so many. So our first, Dami. our first few days there, wala pang enforced lockdown. Mm -hmm. So we were able to get our contractors to do an extension of our balcony. And then when it was fully locked down, um, David did well. We both did tiles in we the, bathroom. the bathroom. Not the best job. Good for now, which but we will redo in yes, the future so we with the proper probably, contractor. Yeah. But it gets the job done. Yes. It was uh, it was an experience because we've never did tiling before. We did a bit of research <laughs> online, and then yeah, it gets the job done. It's nice, no man. Uh oh, and then we did stairs that go to the second level. Another home job, which got the job done. But yes, now we have new stairs. We have burnt new stairs. my hands. Because um, we used our hands to like mold the cement. Uh oh, and then our we hands didn't know. Peeled. We didn't know. Um, and then David yeah. did pathways from oh, yeah, the, square the main entrance to the to the balcony to the receiving area oh. and then i did some paint work i did some oh, yeah, artworks did, yeah, around the, artworks, the house yeah, like the artworks pretty nice i didn't know gwen has a finger for i know paint work and rather then, hand hand rather for paint work and then we put blinds around the oh, whole yeah, the living blinds, area. Yeah. Yes. Bamboo then made blinds. extension sa ano, uh, may dining Your, area na. So those are home improvements na. So pagkatapos nung ECQ, nung GCQ na, we started um, extensions and improvements to the whole cabin. So mm. we added two more cabins and then one dorm style bathroom and one storage room and another kitchen outdoor kitchen storage and laundry yes which is going to be in a whole different video, video yeah. because it's too hard to explain but yun it was a really really good experience and i hope you guys enjoyed this video going through all the video the videos and pictures really made us oh yeah seeing people from growing up and being at the farm uh and just reminiscing seeing all that really makes us miss the farm yeah we really want to go back and yeah it's just the lifestyle there is iba talaga no so yon. So we shall be back there next week. Stay tuned to more videos next week. Thank you so much for following our journey. Please don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. We love you guys. Bye, Bye mates. You.